Hey everybody, it's me again, Kale. Here once more playing Tales of Asperia. Last time we left off, the hype is on! As Rago and his mercenary band are fleeing to his own private ship, Yuri and the gang give chase in order to stop his evil ways of exploiting the people. What the hell am I doing here? Here we go! Now or never. <laughs> Grab him and jump. These are all Blastia cores. This motherfucker's been stealing shit. Why are there so many? And they're all just core. I have no idea. We don't even have this many at the laboratory. Could this be connected to the core thief? Wouldn't be surprised. Could be. But I thought the one behind everything was a huge guy with one eye. That doesn't fit Rago at all. Then he might not be the only one pulling the strings. I wonder if the core from the lower quarter is here someplace. <clears throat> Sorry, none of these are big enough. No, oh, lame. Well, what are you and your little daggers gonna do? I knew it! These guys are with the Blood Alliance! They're one of the five master guilds. Seem like assholes, if you ask me. Oh man. All right, all right. Bandido. Well, Bandido. Magic lens. All right, you're a wuss. Here I come. Ow. Are these guys connected to the Blastia Thief too? Just what is the magistrate <clears throat> up to? No good. No good at all. All right, Dick Face, get out here. Way. Well, that happened. Ha! Was that spineless worm Rago running from a bunch of kids? One eye. One eye giant. So you're the one getting people to bring you all these cores? Maybe I am. Whoa, he got a big sword. You're quick, and you got guts too. My arm's gonna feel that. Wish I had you in my kill. How flattering. But it's bushy guys like you I have to watch out for. Upsets the harmony of the guild, see? Nothing personal. Barbos, what are you waiting for? Dispose of these brats. I did all the work you paid me for. Besides, the knights will be here soon. Rather not have those guys following me around. Next time we meet, you kids won't be getting off so easy. Oh, and who's gonna stop us from kicking your ass right now? Wait, he's still inside. Damn! Zoggy, we'll leave the rest to you! Uh oh. Oh, of course. Damn it. Who is it? Who do I get to kill this time? What's up? You're the one from the castle! Looks like we're stuck with this guy. Oh, they're gonna blow the ship up. My blade, it aches to kill. I've got to kill something. Whoa, go easy on me this time. Sorry, he's got an imitatable face. You think you can kill me? Go ahead, try it. You trust me, I will. Yes! Cry out! Ride in pain! Die for me! What the hell are you trying to do? Please, hey, asshole, over here. <laughs> you can't hurt me. So we'll just keep pounding you until the end. Hey, asshole, I got a surprise for you. I remember this fight, right? I remember hearing rumors about this particular battle. Get over here. Don't go after her. Her quarrel's with me. Holy power, 
You are hard to pin down. We get to come over here eventually. Oh damn. Damn it. Oh sure, his launches me over all the way from over here. You're supposed to be able to knock him off the side of the ship, but it's really hard on not the uh on not a new game plus. Ow. Uh, did I not get a... probably didn't get a thing on you, did I? Let's get a thing on you real quick before I kill you. Cause you're getting pretty close, I'm not gonna lie. Whoa, ow. Bring him over here. Bring him over here, it'll be funny as hell. If I can get him knocked off the ship, that'd be hilarious. Hey, Dingus. Hey, Dingus. Knock him off. Ah, he's dead anyway. Oh well, I tried. Don't let me see you again. I agree. Determined fighter. You're a ranger. Get over it. Ugh, that hurts. Well, you put up a good fight. I. I retreated. <laughs> You're tough. Yes, tough. You're definitely tough. I certainly won't forget that, Yuri. I'm going to kill you, Yuri. I'm gonna carve you into little pieces. Don't move a muscle. <laughs> and he's gone. Thankfully, the ship took care of it for me. What? It's sinking! Round up as many blasts as you can. Everyone into the water. <laughs> Is anyone there? Oh, wait, hold on. Yuri! Esteles! No! But... But... Shut up and jump! Aw, she cares. Thanks, Rita. Way to slowly become a good friend. Everybody okay? In the event of emergency... Uh, Carol's bag can be used as a flotation device. I am, but Yuri... Huh? Yuri! Thank goodness! I saved a dude. Oh, man, that's salty. I must have drank a bucket full. Yeah, you're gonna want to get out of this, uh, this ocean as soon as possible. Who's that? Yoder. Yoder? What? You know him? Look, a boat! We're saved! Hey! Over here! It's Flynn, isn't it? Yeah. It looks like everyone made it through unharmed. Good to see you, buddy. Master Yoder! Wait, I'll pull you out. Sodia, give me a hand. Let's make us even. I seem to have saved an official. Or just make my bounty even higher, because that's also one way this could go. Ah, Capuatorum. I think I may have seen the Wonder Chef. I owe you my thanks. You saved my life. Welcome, buddy. Hey, who is this guy? Um, well, you see... I've made arrangements at the inn. We can discuss things further there. 
You'll come, won't you? Nothing better to do. And you know, I'm always down for exposition. Exposition is what I live for. I thought you were done for when the ship sank with you still on it. Seriously, I was pretty worried there for a minute. I'm glad you made it. It sank faster than I thought it would. I was a little freaked out myself. You almost died and you were just a little freaked out? There's something wrong with you. <laughs> yeah, I'm a weird guy. By the way, nice disguise. <laughs> Guess you found me! You're pretty good. I'll teach you to cook as a reward. Ooh, fried chicken and fries. Mm. I'll give you this so you can practice. Gotta go. Till we meet again! For cuisine! I guess weird. What about this fried chicken, though? What what it do? Ooh, increases magic attack. Nice. I like it being a party food. This little this little finger bits of breast meat and thighs and all that good stuff, and some French fries on the side. Mmm, 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 mmm. Kind of makes me want some chicken. You sure know a lot of strange people. No is a strong like word. Like that raven guy we met at Capua Nor? Or that Zoggy weirdo who attacked us? Weirdo is putting it mildly. What's his deal, anyway? That's what I'd like to know. It's nice to have fans, but this is ridiculous. No it looked like he went down with the ship, though. Maybe that was the last of him. I don't know. Common sense just doesn't seem to apply to those kinds of people. Man, I really don't want to see him again. Well, even if we do, he'll be gunning for Yuri, not us. I've got nothing to do with this. We'll sure, do with that you know. when the time comes. Trust me, you're gonna slowly get invested. Everybody does. Frog, you close down Capua Nor part. And now we can't even run our liner service. Your accent is weird, dude. Oh, they got an orphanage here. Aw, oh, that's nice. Glad to see someone cares. You know? Oh, there's six continents. Neat. Lore. Hopefully I get to see all of them. Um, the, 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 the warehouse can't go in there. Can't go in the lighthouse. All these fancy places I just can't go into. All right, let's find an inn. Wait, cat, cat. I want the cat. He looks cute. He's doing a stretch. Oh, he's a big kitty. All right, fine. Can I go down the slides? Damn. Ruin all my fun, why don't you? Can't go down slides, can't pet the cat. Oh, Art, the Fortune Maker's HQ. People are kind, the weather's not too hot, not too cold. Best of all, the president isn't here. That's a man who understands the inner, the finer points of business. I wonder how Kaufman's doing. I haven't seen her since the gate. I imagine that building will become more important later in the game. Hey, any new synthesis? This is, this is, this is. Ooh, the leather whip plus one. Don't mind if I do. HP condition. 
don't know what HP condition is. Ground shield? Heck yeah. Alright, did that. I've already done that, but I'm not certain. Probably haven't had any soft tails yet. I don't think I've fought a thorn wiggle. I think I'd remember fighting something called a thorn wiggle. Just saying. Let's see. Yeah, I don't have any uh, tall beacon stuff yet. Can upgrade that. Great axe, though. Might as well do that. Yeah, just in case we get back attacked, and we need to have the uh, Carol on his best. Or as good as it can get. Sure. I haven't upgraded him to the Heavy Maul yet. Give him one of those, too, so that he's not skipping anything. I have a Gladius on hand. I don't need to buy one. Uh... No. Nope. No good weapons for anybody else. Oh, I got a cat hair band. I want one. Oh, Lamelier. Nice. Yeah, no, hook me up with some of that. Oh, little mad scientist. Nice. And, uh, yeah, if I can, I might as well get a Lamelier Guard as well. It's a little better than uh, the Breast Guard. Oh, I'm out of tough leather. Damn. I make a thief. I already have a thief jacket. We're good there. Steel protector is the next one on the, on the list, but I haven't found a roper to take a tentacle from yet. I gotta find a Hypionia tree bark because this provides me extra gold, and I love anything that increases my sick gains after battle. Alright, anyway, let's uh, take a quick moment to go through and equip everybody. Yuri's looking rough. Uh, there's some better armor in the meantime there, buddy. I forgot to equip your... I forgot to equip a lot of things, honestly. I've been, I've been really off the ball on my whole party maintenance shtick. Lamelier's just better. There you go, girl. Still haven't finished that experience share. Dang. Here's all the hand-me-downs, buddy. You got a lot of stuff to master. Keep on keeping on, buddy. And the end. Beautiful. Oh, it's a direct mirror to the, the in the other town. Nice. Let's get a good night's sleep. Save the game. And then go talk to Flint. See if we can't get our next course of action. Flynn's not here. Is I wrong that we were meeting Flynn at the end? Other room.
Yes. Have we met somewhere? Convenient time for amnesia. I know somebody who can fix that for you. Amnesia? I'm terribly sorry, but this is the first time we've met. Are you crazy? Magistrate, your crimes are undeniable. These people have seen everything. As I've just been explaining, someone had assumed my identity and was trying to ruin my reputation. It was most upsetting. Liar! I saw those people you fed to the monsters with my own two eyes! Well, Sir Flynn, who are you to believe? These young ruffians or me, a member of the council? If you have plausible deniability, Flynn, you can just... Or not plausible deniability. You have uh, reason to suspect, whatever it's called. You should be able to get a warrant that supersedes his authority. Flynn. It's settled then. I bid you all good day. Flynn, I'm disappointed. Who does that guy think he is? And who the hell is he? <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Settle down. This is... This is His Royal Highness Yoder, candidate for the Imperial Throne. <laughs> oh no, I just swore at the future Emperor. <laughs> huh? <laughs> yeah, right, Estelle. Good one. <laughs> what? I'm only one of the candidates. It's true. With the passing of the previous Emperor, Master Yoder is a rightful heir to the throne. Oh shit. R really? Nice. First hand meeting yes. with the future Emperor? An alleged well, that. Imperial heir captured by a so-called magistrate. That's interesting. I see. Then this incident means that I... Also, do you and Flynn have the same hairdresser? So I see the similar too style. too juicy for public consumption, huh? I... I just... It's got something to do with your decision to leave the castle, doesn't it? <sighs> do whatever you want. I've got no interest in an empire that just sits and does nothing while its people suffer in plain sight. Yuri, and what have you changed by turning your back on such an empire? We need just laws laid down by the government to ensure that people can live lives of stability and peace. Those same laws just let Rago walk out that door. Which is why you and I became knights, Yuri. To change things like that. If we couldn't make it happen by yelling about it from below. Then we said we'd gain honor and trust, and fix the Empire from within. Remember? So, in order to get ahead in life, I'm supposed to stand by while somebody feeds little kids to monsters? Is that it? You want me to look the other way when our people in the lower quarter are being bled dry by taxes? It's because I can't do those things that I quit being a knight. I know, but has anything changed because you quit? Has anything changed because you stayed? <clears throat> How is anything different than it was before you joined the Knights? Wait, I'm coming too! I've done it again. I only want for him to move on with his life. To quit sitting around. Flynn, I... I mean... My apologies for such an embarrassing scene. I mean, he's moving on now. It was just... What do you intend to do a next? A different direction, you know? Would it be all right if I go with him? Why? I feel like so much has changed during my travels with Yuri. The Empire, the world, I've changed as well. Lady Estelise. Understood. Man, Rita's very impatient right now. I can see that tapping foot. You there, young man. What? Who? What? Huh? Who? M me? Carol? <laughs> Tell Yuri to take good care of this young lady. Okay. Is it really all right? I would rather do the job myself, but I'm afraid my current duties won't allow it. 
And as long as you're with him, I can be certain you'll be safe. You believe in him, don't you? I do. If you guys are finished, can we get going? We'll lose him if we don't hurry. Hello. I'm royal window dressing. Don't mind me. I'll, I'll be important later in the story. I promise. Damn, he knows how to get to me. I know better than anyone that nothing's changed. I guess I should look for clues about the Blastia Core. Yeah, but... You know... You need two signs of the coin of change. Somebody stirring up trouble from without, and someone trying to make those changes permanent from within. The guys are perfect. Looks, Barbo should stick out like a sore thumb walking around in town. But it'd sure help if anyone saw where he and his gang were headed. Come to think of it, I wonder what happened to Raven back in Rago's palace. I guess he panicked and ran when the Dragon Rider and the Knights showed up. I wouldn't be surprised. Someone riding a dragon is pretty, pretty intense. Donglist. Pretty hardcore name. Probably shouldn't hit the field without my allies. Guess we'll do a little bit of investigation before we call it quits here. Oh. Well, that's helpful. Hey, guy. How's it going? Hey, it's him. Huh? <laughs> hey there. Long time no see. We met yesterday. Isn't there something else you should be saying? Something else? Hmm. Can't think of anything. Well, they say the deceived have better memories than the deceivers, don't they? I'm just terribly misunderstood. Honest. Uh-huh. You need to see a doctor for your tendency to unconsciously cause trouble to others. You might see if you can get that foul mouth of yours checked out, too. Oof. You had a comeback for everything, huh? If you don't stop putzing around, the knights are gonna throw you back in jail. Ha! <laughs> The knights are a bit too busy to bother with me. I saw a rough-looking guild group moving to the northwest not too long ago. You don't say. The knights can't just turn a blind eye to them, can they? Rough-looking, you say? Was it the Blood Alliance? Beats me. By the way, what was your business back there? Nothing special. I was looking for an apatheia. A what a what? What is an apatheia? It's supposed to be like a really strong core. Heard that it was there, but I guess I had the wrong information. I see. An apatheia. Oh, Yuri! Hey, over here! Uh, I'll get you, old man! <laughs> Nobody hmm. deceives me! Maybe I'd best be off now. Yep, the Amazonist has emerged. <laughs> you know, you could just call her the Amazonian. And Wait, damn it. Adding the S is superfluous. <sighs> Why'd you let him get away? He said he's terribly misunderstood. What? What does that mean? It means he's probably a good guy. No way. I'll catch that bugger one of these days. You should leave him be. Going up against that kind of guy is just a waste of energy. You all right? Just let me take a, a little break. Not used to fall, to run along sure, with me. Sure, you can have a little one. Then we've got to go. Go? Go where? We need to follow the Blood Alliance to get back the lower quarters blast you. Did you get a lead on where to go next? I heard that a shady group from a guild was headed to the northwest. It might be them. To the northwest of here. The only city I hey, can think of in that direction would be one that was destroyed in an earthquake. What could they want to do in a place like that? Well, if it's still got a decent defenses, it's probably not a terrible place to set up shop and do some illicit business. Hmm, good question. And yet, you still want to go? I'm just saying we should go and check it out. I mean, curiosity is curiosity. Hey, Carol, do you know anything else about that city you said was destroyed in an earthquake? Just rumors. Supposedly, it was some guild's headquarters about ten years mm. ago. Which guild was that? Sorry, I can't help you there. Even more interesting. I've never heard of an earthquake that destroyed an entire city. Well, Ospio is across the ocean. Maybe the information just never made it that far? Hmm, I wonder. Well, regardless, it's a damn good lead. And I do love me a good lead. But I think we'll follow that lead 
in the next episode. We've done quite a bit today. We've at the very least hindered a terrible individual from doing terrible individual things. And I suspect we'll get back to dethroning him sometime in the future. But for now, our hands are tied with the law enforcement pretty thick right as it is. Damn having to do things by the book every now and again. Anyway, hope you're all still enjoying yourselves, and if you are, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe down below. Leave me with some good vibes. We'll come back and go investigate this one-eyed bastard and his gang of nerdy wells next time. Till then, though, you will have yourselves a fabulous day. And I'll see you the next adventure. Oh, wait, hold on. The breeze that blows in a port city makes everything feel so different. It is really it nice. It smells like the sea. Stand in the ocean wind too long and you'll get covered in salt, you know. Thank you for ruining my mood. Hey, feel free to get all sticky and gross. I won't stop you. They're good friends. Later!